Uh, you're going to hear from Mr. Weiner today. I had Mr. Weiner come in on a, a trial that I had, and I think it was a case that was extremely indicative of, of what the drug impact area has been able to do for the community. Uh, it was a case where uh, walking beat uh, officers uh, interrupted a hand-to-hand -hand drug deal in Old Town. Uh, they spoke with uh, the buyer who had a $10 bill in her hand and was about to hand it to the dealer. Uh, they interrupted that drug deal. When the dealer was walking away, he tossed his crack on the ground, right? No care for uh, the school children that may be walking by. Uh, you know, he just wanted to drop that on the ground. It's a tough case. It's not a lot of crack. He didn't have a lot of cash on him. It's one that, you know, potentially would not be picked up, not be focused on. Uh, but the defendant in that case was extremely bad guy. Violent personal convictions, previous drug dealing. He had a drug dealing charge from 1988, two blocks away. The guy's been in it forever. Now, the purchaser, uh, the police officer, spoke with her and didn't charge her with a crime and said, hey, listen, come in and, 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 and speak at grand, grand jury. Turns out she was really struggling with addiction. She did come into grand jury. She came into trial to testify. When I got out, went out to get her in the courtroom, she was waiting. I could tell she's nervous. It's nerve wracking to testify against a guy like this. And uh, she looked at me and said, hey, listen, the reason I'm here today is uh, to make sure that people like me don't have to deal with people like him. Uh, that's what the project is trying to do, uh, get people treatment and, and people who don't want it uh, to make sure that they can't uh, impact. So I appreciate it. Uh, I think that there is a lot to do with this project. I think it's been successful. <clears throat> it's taken a long time to uh, you know, develop these open-air drug markets. It's going to take some time to uh, shut them down.